up guys it's Maggie and I'm here doing a Minecraft Comes Alive mod review and basically what it does is it turns your boring little Squidward villagers into interactive NPCs which I think is very cool um unfortunately I accident not accidentally I killed my last husband because he's kinda of being dumb um so this guy he's gonna be my new husband and I'm gonna show you how um, so, first what you gotta do is get his hearts up, um, I kinda cheated and I just gave him a diamond block, I mean, who oh man doesn't love diamonds? <laughs> um, so yeah, he's almost 200 hearts, so I can definitely marry him. Uh, this is how you make the engagement ring, and then he'll be your fiancé. And then have kids and such, you gotta make him the wedding band. It's probably not the right name for it, but that's what I'm calling it. So, I'm gonna go in here, and I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna give him his engagement ring. He didn't really interact to that, but he's my fiance. I've heard that's you're a dick, but um, no, 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 no. Um, interact. Gift. He's a king now because I'm the queen of this no man land. <clears throat> um, well, he just hit me. It's abuse. Um, so now I can procreate with him and have children, such as these ones. It's a boy. Let's name him Billy. No. Let's name him Joey. Um, okay, he can care for that child because I'm too lazy for that. But you know what he can do? He can make me a sandwich. If I go cook food. Now, he should be making me a sandwich. Not a sandwich, but <laughs> we'll see if he does that. Right now, it doesn't seem to be working. But what I can also do with my darling kids, I have four of them, but there's only three here. Um, I can make them do chores, so I'm going to get these guys to maintain the farm. Oh, what a good kid. Hey, you, you got to do chores, too. Oh, look at shoes. Woo, enthusiasm. Um, so this is the crafting recipe for the whistle, and basically what it does is that when you right click it, your family will all teleport to you. So if you ever lose them, you can just right click that, and they will be right there. Um, moving on. Oh, they're going to give me a gift, but I know as soon as I accept it, I will crash. So, I'm going to ignore their gift giving, and I am going to make them have babies. And basically it's the same as the, um... Uh, the wedding ring, um, but this is the ranger's ring, and it's made of 8 iron, and we're going to give that to them. There, now they are married. Um, so it automatically gives it to both of them. Um, I'm going to make them have babies as well. So they're going to make a babies with all the love hearts. And it is a girl. Alright, so that's basically how you do that. And... There was a glitch, I think they fixed it, where um, sometimes the males had female names, but yeah, lately when I've spawned them, they've had male names again, so maybe that was just a glitch that they fixed. Um, so I'm going to go tag. So if it happens to you, and you're in survival, and you want to change their name, I don't think this works on husbands or kids, but you can name them this way. So instead of Matthew, I'm going to name him Matt, because... He would rather have it short, I guess. There, ready? That magic, though. So, Matt and what is your name? Bailey. Okay, moving on. So, this is the monarch crown, and I am currently wearing it. Um, you have to craft it to become monarch, so if you're playing in creative, you can't just get it out, you need to craft it. And this is how you craft it. Um, this is the air crown. Um, so if you die, uh, this is uh, who you will kind of like look to, I guess. I'm not sure if she like becomes queen or um, if she. I know I've had it done before where um, she takes your stuff and yeah. So I'm gonna give this to her because she's not taking it. There we go. Now, I think it's because I already gave her an air crown, that's why she's not accepting it. Um, 
So yeah, you can also make five different colored crowns, and they look something like this, and except for you can change the dye to pink, green, blue, purple, or red, and I'm going to take the blue and the green. Um, oopsie. My bad. Oh no, that's the shirt. So basically this is the monarch clothing. I'll just put on the pants because I'm not wearing pants in game right now. I meant in game. So that's how you craft the shirt. That's how you craft the pants. And those are the boots. Uh, okay. A few more things to show you. Something that is new to this update is that you can actually let them wear um, dyed leather armor. So, inventory. I'm going to give her, actually I'm going to give her the green, you know what, ladies can wear green quite well, so that's what she's going to have. And I gave her the little crown, and then these two knuckleheads are going to have blue, and I'll give them the blue crown, and unfortunately I did not have an extra crown I don't think, so his head's just going to have to get cold, oopsie. I am like the best mother ever. Okay, another thing that is new to this uh, update is I can go like that and wha-bam she can ride the vanilla horses and I think this is super cool. Much easier way of transpor transporting them. Oh gosh. So if I go follow me and I get her to follow me. She's just gonna... Oh, of course that donkey is slow. We got that ass. It's super slow. Um, you know what? I don't like you, and if I demand gift, it'll crash my game. So I'm just gonna execute you. <laughs> but, oh, she took the saddle with her. What the butt? Wow, what a hoe bag. Um, so I'm pretty sure that covers most of this mod. Super fun mod. I would, I would recommend it. Um, unfortunately, I can't talk today, so. But yeah, it's a great mod and super fun if you like playing survival mode and single player, I guess. Um, I think it may work multiplayer. I am not 100% sure on that. But yeah, it's a good mod. And Oops, accidentally uh, crashed my software, so it cut off. But with that, I will bid you a farewell, and I hope you all have a very nice day, night, morning. Goodbye!